Thanks, everybody. We are here for the 10th annual presentation of the Peter Marr Good Guy Award, obviously named for the goodest guy of all. Uh, a historic day because for the first time we have co-winners, a uh, probably fitting with all the one goal games that it was close right to the end and <laughs> this time finished in a tie. So I will uh, hand it over to Peter Marr to make the presentation. Thank you very much, uh, Wes, and uh, 10 years. I can't believe that it's been uh, that long since we initiated this uh, particular award. So it's uh, really a pleasure to um, have it named in uh, my honor for the media people that I used to spend every day of the winter with. And looking around the room here now, uh, a lot of the guys and girls that I was around uh, back in my day are still here. So uh, and doing a great job at your, uh, your chosen profession. So. Great to see you, and uh, unfortunately, the season's not going to go a little longer. I would have liked to come to a few more games here at the Saddle Dome, but uh, there's always next year. And But it's uh, my pleasure to um, introduce the co-winners of the award of this year, standing over here to my uh, right, Blake Coleman, who um, I never did have the pleasure of calling a game in the NHL. Blake, you started in the NHL just as I was leaving. So... Uh, I watched you play several, several, several games here in person and lots of games on TV when you're in Tampa and here and elsewhere. So uh, congratulations on uh, winning this good guy award. I know on the ice you're not such a good guy, and that's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> and the guy next to him is the, uh, the last game that I broadcast for the Flames. This guy is the only player left on the Flame team from uh, my last broadcast in uh, Vancouver, the night that Johnny Goudreau scored his first goal, and I called my last flame goal. And uh, Michael Backlund played in that uh, particular game and played in a lot of hockey games before that uh, with the Flames before I uh, retired. He was always a good guy then and glad to see that uh, he's still being a good guy off the ice with you people in the media. And again, he's not such a good guy on the ice, which is a good thing as well. So you guys come forward. It's my pleasure to uh, make the presentation to you. Uh, well, first of all, uh, thank you guys. Obviously, it's uh, it's an honor to uh, to be recognized uh, for this award. It's um, you know I have a great relationship with a lot of you guys, and I've gotten to really know some of you guys pretty personally. And um, you know, and it's, there's a lot of good people in this room, and you guys are are all uh, on that same grind that we are. And, and you know, it's it's a tough job. It's demanding hours. It's a lot of uh, you know a lot of paying attention, and, and you know you got to be on top of things, and you guys have been really good. And um, you guys have always treated me and, and my family, uh, which is most important to me, uh, with a ton of respect. And uh, I really appreciate that. Um, it means a lot to us, and, and it goes a long way. And um, you know, I don't know that I do anything too special. I, I just uh, I know you guys are all are all people, and you're all working hard like we are. And, and I try to treat you guys um, the way that I would want to be treated. And um, I know I know Michael does that uh, as well. And um, Again, I just want to say thank you guys. I know it's, you know, it's it's a really disappointing day for us. Um, you know, it's not where we want to be. It's not where I want to be uh, in terms of how the season just ended up. But, uh, you know, tough times. It's nice to have good people around. So, again, thank you. Um, it's an honor to, to get this from you guys, and I look forward to working with you in the, in the future. No clapping? <laughs> 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 Good guy, <or> that. <laughs> uh, well, how to top that off? That was a good speech. Uh, <laughs> no, um, yeah, I feel the same. Uh, very honored and um, thankful to receive this award, and especially in Peter's name. Uh, got to know him and work with him for a few years, and uh, um, and then I worked a lot of years with a lot of you guys, and. Uh, you guys always been great to me and always showed a lot of respect, like Colsey said, to me and my family. And uh, um, I always appreciated even my first few years for you who, who were here. It wasn't always easy for me and uh, being a first round pick. And um, you guys never disrespected me anyway or treated me badly or said things uh, maybe behind my back, but not that I heard. <laughs> and uh, uh, not that I hear everything and read everything, but. Uh, when I was young, I read more stuff, and there was never anything. Uh, yeah, so I really appreciate that, uh, working with a lot of you guys for such a long time. And um, like Colton said, you guys work really hard, and we appreciate the hard work you put in. And 
to promote us and to promote the sport and uh yeah and uh yeah, it feels uh, it's nice to win it with a nice guy, co co winners with a good guy over there, and uh, I uh, yeah, once again just thank you, and uh, uh, it's an, it's an honor to always win a prestigious award. So thank you.